This is one of the best custom themed keyboards that you can find on Amazon right now for around $80. This is the XVX MK61 60% Coal Theme Custom Keyboard. Now, if you are interested in this keyboard in particular, I have done an in-depth review that I will leave linked in the description so you can check it out. If you do wanna pick up this keyboard, there will be a kit link down in the description as well that helps out the channel through affiliate links to where you can purchase this keyboard yourself. This keyboard comes with the options of Gateron yellow, brown, or reds. If you're not using your own switches in this keyboard, then I recommend getting the Gateron reds and not the yellows. I've gotten the Gateron yellows and I've noticed after using this keyboard for about two months now that it does not register my inputs when I'm actually typing or playing video games half the time. With that being said, it's still a wonderful keyboard that I will be using for my streaming PC, but since my editing slash gaming PC is arriving soon, I wanted a keyboard that still would allow me to have that small slim form factor, but also have the keys necessary for editing and dedicated keys for delete and print screen, as well as being good for gaming. Here is that 60% bigger brother, the 75% XVX MK84, cool theme, keyboard. Now this keyboard has the same custom theme that you find on the 60% keyboard with the same curved PBT keycaps as well as hot swappable switches available in the same switches as the Gateron yellows, the Gateron reds, and the Gateron browns. You can find it on Amazon for around 86 bucks. So just a little slight markup just to get this keyboard over the 60%. Like I stated previously, both keyboards come with hot swappable switches as well as the curved PPT keycaps. Both keyboards have 19 lighting effects and nine selectable colors with four brightness levels and four customizable lights. Both keyboards are wireless or you can use it in a wired mode for connectivity. Now let's talk about some pros of this keyboard. This keyboard not only has the arrow keys, but also has the F row up top, and on top of that has a dedicated delete key, home key, and print screen key that I need for my editing. Another pro to me is that it takes up less desk space because it's in that 75% layout versus a regular 10 keyless keyboard. And then my third pro is the fact that it can be used in a wireless mode or wired mode and works seamlessly in both connectivity. Moving on to the cons of this keyboard. The cons are really hard to find because I feel like it comes down to personal preference. This keyboard in particular doesn't even have any feet in the back of the keyboard, but it is at a seven degree for ergonomic design. That might be a breaking point for some people. Another con is the switches themselves. Like I said before, with the 60% keyboard, the Gateron yellows might be a problem or an issue. Again, I don't know if it was just the switches that I got in particular in that keyboard, or it's just the Gateron yellows in period. With that being said, I did get this keyboard in the Gateron reds, and I've noticed no problems whatsoever. So just keep that in mind. And I guess the third con that some people might not like, it does have a lot of RGB modes, but they're feel really generic and that's on both keyboards themselves but there's not really a whole bunch of unique options even though they have 19 different options but if you find that as a con then I don't really know what you would expect as far as RGB from a keyboard but I guess that's one nitpick if you really wanted to find something I guess but for me personally I like the RGB on this keyboard all right, before we move on to the sound test, I do wanna let you guys know what comes in the box for this keyboard. You will get a wireless dongle as well as a USB type C cable for charging, as well as a keycap puller and a switch puller alongside the actual keyboard itself. All right, let's do a quick sound test on both keyboards.
sound test out the way, this has been a review of the XVX MK84 Coral C themed keyboard that you can find on Amazon for around 86 bucks. If you're interested in this keyboard in particular, you can follow the kit link down in the description to purchase this keyboard for yourself. Any purchases made through that kit link to any of the items that I use are affiliate links and it helps support the channel. I will see you guys in the next review. Take care, have a Squirtastic day. God bless you and yours. And if you're interested in the previous 60% keyboard, you can find it on your screen. And if you're interested in my setup tour, you can find that on the screen as well. I'll see you guys in the next one.